Hey everyone, it's iPhone Obsession here to show you my favorite City of Tweaks slash themes. And I will put all the sources into the description to show you what sources you need to get these tweaks slash themes. Now, if you don't know how to add sources onto Cydia, what you do is you'll go into Cydia and go to Manage, Sources, Edit, Add the sources that are in the descriptions. So here we go. The first one I want to show you is Color Keyboard. And once you download it off of Cydia, it will go straight into the settings. And as you can see, you have a wide variety of different colors. And you can check what they look like before you put them on. Well, most of them. And there's also a pop-up key. So when you press a certain key on the keyboard, there's a color that goes over it. And then you can also put pictures in the background. So this is for regular standing up like this and then landscape when you have it to the side. And, now, and then you save it, whatever. Now the next one I'm going to show you is Fake Carrier. So once you download Fake Carrier off of Cydia, it will be an app. And it will look like the bars. And what it does is it changes the AT&T to whatever you want or the Verizon Sprint whatever and very simple very simple now the next one I want to show you is winterboard which everyone should know what winterboard is and if you haven't you should probably have would have downloaded it already but if you haven't downloaded it now um, and what it does is you can turn on themes from winterboard when you download them off of Cydia now the next one I want to show you is barrel and right when you, of course, after you download, it will be in settings. And the you go to mode, and it has a bunch of different styles of when you turn your icons, change your icon. And as you can see, mine is on mine is on phase f page fade, as you can see like that. Very cool app. They have made a number two, but I haven't bothered to download it. Now the next one I want to show you is colored knob. And what color knob does is you can make your slider a certain amount of colors. Basic, basic colors, basic. You can make a long slider, random colors going off. Basic tweak. Now the next one I want to show you is activator. And what activator does is pretty much anything, like not literally anything, but Say if I double press the home button, it would change my next track, pause my song, you know, do whatever, etc., etc. Check that out. It's pretty cool. Now, the next one I want to show you is InfiBoard. And what InfiBoard does is it makes you able to have as many apps on one screen as you want. I'll show you that right now. As you can see, I have five going across the top instead of the regular four and it, you can scroll down up you can put as many apps as you want on one page and also there is infinity dock and what that does is what it says you can put the max is 10 you can put as many apps as you want on the dock and the next one I want to show you is slider pro and what slider pro does is you can change your time color etc what your time says it can't even it will it doesn't even have to be time you can write whatever you want change your date whatever date color and you can also custom custom text your slider instead of it saying slide here to open or whatever it says regularly now the next one I want to show you is speed intensifier and what that does is what it says as you if you haven't noticed how fast my phone goes when I turn it on. You can also put it to the slowest default, like the regular five. I put mine on the fastest, of course. But also, it's really good to have when you go into Cydia because it will load it faster instead of taking 10 minutes. Now, the next one I want to show you is Vexilum. And what this does is when you get notifications and their banners, as they will come up on the top you can change the color instead of it being white and plain as you can see I have mine blue and you can change the font color like whatever it is 
Now the next one I want to show you is volume customize. And what volume customize does is you can make see how that's blue? You can make your volume blue or whatever you want pretty much. Whatever you like. Now the next thing I want to show you are the themes. As you can see this theme it's pretty cool. I really like it. It's really neat. It makes the app smaller. It changes every single app, not just the main apps that you get with the phone. Like my Instagram, see how it's smaller? It's the same size as every other app. Now, what that is called is Acon. And that is a really, really nice theme that you get off Cydia. Now, there is also another that I like, and it is called Ascent Blue. And I'm going to turn this on and show you guys what it looks like. It'll take a second. Now, as you can see, my keyboard has changed to blue. There are also different themes like this. They are called Ascent Red, Ascent Blue, Ascent Green, whatever. As you can see, my bars have changed to blue, lock, button, and also battery. It is a really nice, clean, clean theme. Um, as you can see, it doesn't really change your apps but it does have that little loading thing. It should have um, a little background to the messaging, but I guess it's not working right now. And it's a pretty nice app. It doesn't really change the icons. It just changes the basics, the time, the battery percentage, you know. It's really, really nice, though. And there's another one I want to show you, just one more, called Carbon Evo. This one is also very, very nice. Just wait a second. As you can see, this is a very, very nice theme. Um, this wouldn't be my favorite. I'd say the first one, the Acon one I had on, was my personal favorite. But as you can see, it changes the border of the time. And it also changes the slider. It's really nice. It does change all the apps, though. That's what I really like. Now, I hope this video helps you guys out. This is my first video, so hope you subscribe. Thanks for watching my video.